A lot of this information is from Wikipedia, and I will be sharing the article in the description of this video. John Bardeen, born May 23, 1908, was an American physicist and electrical engineer. He won the Nobel Prize in Physics twice for his work on the transistor in 1956 and again in 1972 for creating the BCS theory. He was the only person ever to be awarded two Nobel Prizes in Physics to this day. He was born in Madison, Wisconsin, and attended University of Wisconsin High School. He graduated from the school in 1923 at age 15. He could have graduated several years earlier, but was postponed because of his mother's death and him taking courses at other high schools at the same time. Bardeen received his Bachelor of Science degree in Electrical Engineering in 1928 from the University of Wisconsin. He eventually went to work for Gulf Research Laboratories in Pittsburgh. After the work failed to keep his interest, he applied and was accepted to the graduate program in mathematics at Princeton University. Under physicist Eugene Wigner, he wrote his thesis on a problem in solid-state physics. Before completing his thesis, he was offered a position as junior fellow of the Society of Fellows at Harvard University in 1935. He spent three years there, working on problems in cohesion and electrical conduction. He received his Ph.D. in mathematical physics from Princeton in 1936. From 1941 to 1944, Bardeen headed the group working on magnetic mines and torpedoes at the Naval Ordnance Laboratory. During this period, his wife Jane gave birth to a son, Bill, and a daughter, Betsy. In October 1945, Bardeen began his work at Bell Labs. He moved his family to Summit, New Jersey. He began working on ways to make better vacuum tubes for computers, radios, and other industrial applications. His group worked tirelessly for two years experimenting and building. On December 23, 1947, Bardeen and his crew succeeded in creating a point contact transistor. The transistor was 1 50th of the size of the vacuum tubes it replaced in televisions and radios, used far less power, was far more reliable, and allowed electrical devices to become more compact. By 1951, Bardeen was looking for a new job. Fred Seitz, a friend of Bardeen, convinced the University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign to make Bardeen an offer of $10,000 a year. Bardeen accepted the offer and left Bell Labs, joining the engineering and physics faculties at Illinois in 1951, where he was a professor of electrical engineering and physics. In 1956, John Bardeen and his crew won the Nobel Prize in Physics for their research on semiconductors and the discovery of the transistor effect. In 1957, Bardeen, in collaboration with Leon Cooper and his doctoral student, John Robert Schrieffer, proposed the standard theory of superconductivity known as the BCS theory. In 1972, Bardeen shared the Nobel Prize in Physics with Leon N. Cooper of Brown University and John Schrafer of the University of Pennsylvania for making their BCS theory. This was Bardeen's second Nobel Prize in Physics. He became the first person to win two Nobel Prizes in the same field. Only four others have ever received more than one Nobel Prize. Bardeen died of heart disease at age 82 on January 30th, 1991.